Hi, this is Apple iPhone School's jailbreak review of the Evasion for 6.0 6.1, and this is for an iPhone 5. So you just download this app and click jailbreak, and you don't do much during the jailbreak, except at one point here we will unlock the iPhone and click an icon that gets installed during the process. Uh, the total process takes about 5 minutes and 40 seconds-ish. Um, we did cut out um, some of the longer wait times in here. It just depends on their servers and uh, you know the newer phones like the iPhone 5 and the newer iPads are going to run a little faster so the jailbreak will take less time. And this jailbreak will do anything that's running 6.0 or 6.1. So that includes the, I, the newest iPhone 5 and the newest iPad and iPad uh, mini. Uh, a couple of different things that you're going to need to know here is you definitely want to have your passcode lock turned off because during the process it reboots and if you're not on top of it, um, it will just get stuck in the process. and. We actually had one of the phones that we were jailbreaking, the one you're watching right now, um, had the passcode on it and we, we removed it during the process, but I wouldn't recommend that. That was pretty risky. Um, and then you'll want to back up, of course, ahead of time. Uh, we use the iCloud backup. And uh, you want to take all your pictures off there if you're not backing those up to the photo stream and any videos that you want off there just in case something were to happen it would be good to have a backup and right now we're about two minutes into the jailbreak and the device is rebooting so again as long as you don't have your passcode lock on you should have no problems here and there'll be some more reboots and uh, progress here on the progress bar. Um, during the editing of this video we uh, obviously already have this done and we've been into Cydia and uh, initially here there's going to be some uh, bad connections or, or uh, errors or um, things not loading in Cydia um, basically because the jailbreak uh, has been on hold for quite a while. Actually, there hasn't been an official one since the f iPhone 5 has been out. And so many people are doing this for the first time for their iPhone 5 or just getting interested in it. The new um, iPhone, well, the old iPhone 4S and iPhone 4 are now discounted with some carriers. So lots of people have iPhones now, more than ever, of course. More countries are getting it and just more people are getting it. So this is really hammering the city of servers and the repositories that save um, all the links to all the you know unofficial apps. And so there will be some errors right now, but it's not going to hurt anything. You're just you're just not going to get through, and you're just going to have to either keep refreshing or try back later. Within a few days, it should die down, and a lot of people get their initial installs done, and then it'll be just kind of like the App Store, Apple's App Store. So here's the point where you're going to need to unlock the phone and the app in the bottom corner here it depends on how many apps you have installed you just want to touch it one time the screen will go black there for a second and you just want to wait don't don't keep pressing it um, this will finish the jailbreak and reboot the system and then uh, you might reboot a couple times here and then you'll have Cydia on your phone when you load Cydia for the first time you want to select that your user. Um, otherwise, it's going to let you see all these um, developer modes and all these extra things that you don't need to see. And so, if you just click user, you'll see all the fun stuff. And uh, it's just kind of like the App Store. There's screenshots, so you can see what the apps look like. And there's descriptions. Some of them cost money that you can use, like PayPal or Google Checkout, to pay for. Um, but most of them are reasonably priced just like the App Store and a lot are free, especially a lot of the designs. Like, uh, you know, you can make Siri look different, you can make the icons look different, your lock screen look different, 
that kind of stuff and just check our website a lot of the previous hacks um, work already or they'll be updated to work with the new 6.0 and if um, if they don't work with your phone the city will recognize your phone and, and not allow it to be installed so you, you should be fine there too um, so here's the the final process this is where this phone actually um, froze at this point uh, for a little while I just fast forwarded it there to basically we just turned it off and turned it back on and city was there so um, first time you open city it'll do this too it'll do a little refresh and then you'll have city on your phone so um, if you have any questions just uh, post in the comments whether this you see this video on YouTube or on our website and we'll try to get back to you thanks